everybody, welcome back to my vlog channel. So, I'm, I'll put you guys down. So I just finished getting ready. I tried on a different set of the magnetic lashes today. They're a little bit thicker. This one's a little far, but I'm afraid to mess with it. So we're just trying it. But last time, I think last week's vlog, um, was the one that I had the Tory Burt shoes that I had to return. Oh, it was so sad, but I think they're gonna be in today. So I actually just got another package from Amazon. I've been waiting for this one because I'm so excited. Amazon, like, I feel like Amazon came out of nowhere and sideswiped Nordstrom, like up one side and down the next. And now even some of the biggest fashion bloggers are like shopping on Amazon. I mean, that fad will come and go. But I've been looking for a really good oversized t-shirt, like one that was meant to be oversized, and I think I found it. So that's in today. And then, like I said, the shoes should be in, but also I got this. So I had preserved my dress, my wedding dress. You guys saw, I think I actually vlogged it when it came back in. Um, we kept my veil out because I wanted like friends to be able to wear it if they wanted to. Whatever, you know, if you want to wear it, you can. Turns out, the friend of mine that's getting married next month, her dress is not the color of my veil. And then I have a friend who's getting married next July. She wants white, white, and that's not the color of my veil. So I just decided that we are going to put it up, but not preserve it yet. Um, so there's one more person that I think would wear it, but if not, I mean, it's no big deal. It's not gonna hurt my feelings. The thing was just so dang expensive. I want somebody to wear it because it was like crazy. So I got this like acid free bag and it's just meant to like store important things for a little while. And um, obviously, you know, it'll get to a point where like we just have to get it preserved, but I didn't. So this, oh my God, it's humongous. What? You guys, look at this bag. Look at this thing. I literally thought it was like tiny. Okay, well, who knows, the veil's big, maybe, whatever. So I'm gonna go down and get my veil in one minute. This is the t-shirt, so I'll link it below. I don't know if you guys are gonna be able. Actually, I'm gonna go put it on. Okay, so my self tanner is pretty much off on my chest. This is what it looks like, I think it's, you can see my bra. I think it's so cute. I have pajama pants on. So it's got kind of like a V-neck situation and then it's got like slightly folded sleeves. Oh yeah, I will totally be buying more of this t-shirt. It's so cute. And I think it was like $13. So I got the gray just to try out and I'm gonna try the white and the black next. You guys know I'm not big into color. So, all right. That's good, that came. <sighs> Busy day. I've already worked so many hours today. Had a conference call first thing this morning. I'm exhausted, but it's okay. So I'm going to take this off because I don't like wearing shirts that haven't been washed yet from like right after I buy them. So I'll be right back. So the veil is down at my mom's house. Um, I'm gonna clean up just like real quick here and then I'm gonna go grab it we'll see how it fits in this thing. <laughs> I mean, it's a cathedral like veil, so maybe like, and it has lace and stuff. So maybe this is like a good thing, but I don't know, we'll see. So, I'll be right back. Okay, all right, why are all the animals like right here? Come on, Sadie. Get down, get down. All right, so. The veil is a lot smaller than I remember when it's all laid out. I mean, this literally is how it looks. Like, it's so sad. Um, we always said we would get it clean if someone wore it, but no one's offered to wear it. So just look at, like, you guys. I wish I could just, like, wear this on a Tuesday or something to work. You know what I mean? Like, I should just be able to wear things like this. Meh. <laughs> it's so long. Look. And it's so funny. It's so pretty. God, it's so pretty. So funny. So my dad was like, there was this brick, like I walked down a brick aisle at this old plantation home. It was beautiful. 
And my dad told me like a month before, because we went for our meeting, my dad was like, I think your van's gonna catch on the bricks as we go down, because it was like also in a tiered garden. And I was like, no, I think it'll be fine. He was like, I don't know. I think it'll catch. And I was like, no. So then wedding rehearsal comes and dad's like, no, what if I just like kind of hold your veil a little bit? Like, I, I think it's going to catch and I'm afraid you're, you're going to get caught. And I was like, no, it caught every time. And like, he literally was, we were about to walk out and he like grabbed the back and he was like, I'll just hold it. And I was like, no, it's fine. It's not going to catch dad. And literally as I stepped out the tears, I was like, oh, oh. <laughs> It's really funny. My mom in the middle of the ceremony, um, I walked under the gazebo because we were signing our marriage license. And my mom, like, I totally think like she does. Quick, how do I get the veil over there to her? Because the veil was like outside of the gazebo. So she literally just picks it up and she goes and throws it. And so of course, I was like this at my head. I was like, oh my God. So then we just started giggling in the middle. Our wedding was so sweet and precious. I'm literally just sitting here wearing this. Our wedding was so sweet and precious. I would not change a thing about it. It was so sweet and we showed our full emotions and we didn't hold anything back and it was just, that's what made it so precious. So it was really sweet, but I don't know how I'm gonna do this. I should have probably gotten some like acid free paper just to wrap it so that the lace doesn't get caught. But I mean, at this point, I don't care. If anything's better than it just sitting down at my mother's house on a table upstairs. So, it's not dirty. I mean, I literally wore it for an hour, probably total. I mean, there's no, no stains, no visible tears. It's time for the, oh my God, this bag is ridiculous. I could have fit my whole bridal party in this thing. I would not have got this bag. I know it was this big. <laughs> Oh my goodness, look at this, you guys. This is so overkill. I don't think there's anything in there. It's okay. So at least the veil is taken care of. I will go put this away. I'll just fold it. There. Um, I'll go put this away and then hopefully someone wears it. And if they don't, in about probably like three years, I'd say. I will get it preserved. And then if someone wants to wear it after that, they just have to get it preserved and send it back. Okay, my shoes came. I was vlogging today. vlogging the other day actually when I got these shoes so I figured I'd vlog again and show them what they look like. Gotcha. Have you seen these? Using a kitchen knife to open I don't know. Don't put that back in that block. Am I not supposed to? No. They're nice. Yeah, you use the knives that are in that drawer right below the knives in the kitchen block. So there are like three or four pocket knives in that drawer. I don't ever know how to close those. Sam, they scare me. It, there's one that really does not have a lock on it. Do not use that kitchen block to do that again. <laughs> yes, sir. You sassy. Are you sassy? I am. Thank God. It's a lot more joke the last time. I'm in the middle of filming a friggin' video, so I gotta use these. I'm so, so glad they came. Look! Cool. You like them? Yeah. These definitely look like they'll fit my foot better. Oh yeah, that fits way better. Can you, look at this. Can you believe there was a half, I had a half size smaller than this? No. Oh. Okay. That still doesn't really look like it's... Shut up. Yes, it does. Okay. Do you not think it does? I mean, it's up to you. If it's comfortable for you, then it's Yeah, fine. it's comfy. I think it looks like it fits. Rude. Totally fits. Okay. 
So, as you guys saw, shoes came. Thank God. I was hoping they'd come because I want to style them with this um, dress that I'm about to put on for my other thing. But I'll show you what they look like on. I definitely think these look like they fit way better. Oh, yeah. Those 100% fit. I don't know what he's talking about. They're really cute. I told myself I needed to start looking better when I vlogged, but... <sighs> I just got done working out, so that is irrelevant right now. All right. Um, I'm going to show you guys a recipe. I showed it on my Instagram stories the other day. If you don't follow me on my Instagram, you should. But I shared it with something that I no longer put in it, and I now add something that I didn't add originally. <laughs> um, so I shared this recipe, and basically I was saying that, like, I... Um, use peanut butter in the recipe. It's a really healthy protein shake. But some of you messaged me and were like, why don't you try the powdered peanut butter? Now, powdered peanut butter is not meant to be like in place of regular peanut butter on like a sandwich or something. It's literally meant for situations like this with um, protein shakes. So I'm trying it today. And you guys are going to be the first to know does it taste the same or not? So this is the, it's PB2 powdered peanut butter that I'm adding in place of regular peanut butter and then chia seeds. All right, let me clean up my chaos a little bit. And I am so sad because I am almost out of protein and almost out of bananas. And this has been my lunch for the last like few days. Um, I have used this as a meal replacement just because it's so filling that I don't see it necessary to eat anything afterwards just because, I mean, why bother? So I purchased a blender recently because I had been craving shakes. Best decision ever. I just got this one off of Amazon. I think it was like on Prime for like 30 bucks, $27. And this is the one I use because you can see it fits it perfectly. It is so good. Oh, so good. Legit, this tastes like, like I know I said the protein shakes taste like chocolate milkshakes, but I guess the consistency, I think, of this tastes a little bit more milkshake-like. So, it is so good. Okay, so it is now a few hours later. Um, I made another shake. I don't know why it looks like it has, I guess that's a lot of foam. Um, I made it with my espresso pods because I needed some more coffee. I'm just not awake today. Um, almond milk, a protein shake, so like the same Premier protein shake, and then just some ice and a little bit of peanut butter powder. Mmm. This is really good, but I wanted to show you guys, I got a PR package from Elizabeth Rose Designs. So they reached out to me on Instagram and wanted to send me this product. And I'm so excited for it. I love bougie packaging. You guys know, I love it. So, oh, yeah, so extra. Oh, well, this is adorable. So it is this like black quilted, oh my God, that is really nice, um, fabric. And what this is, oh my God, this is so nice, is a jewelry organizer. So you literally can sort all of your jewelry. This little pouch is made, I know this because like I've stalked their Instagram. This little mate pouch is made, you can pull this out. It's just got all these little compartments so that when you travel, you can take all your jewelry. So cute, I love that it has, I don't know if you guys can see barely, there's all these little dots in here. So like you can, cause I have one of these and I like it, but it does not have these little holes. So like it ruins my earring backs and it is not this nice. Like it's not, bless you sir. Oh, well, that is just adorable. So it's so cute for when you travel. How cute is this? Oh my gosh. It's got a little 
place for your rings, your necklaces, your bracelets, earrings. I love it. So thank you to Elizabeth Rose Designs. So excited to share that with my followers. Mm. Tired, y'all. I'm really tired. All right, friends, it has been a wild week here. I have barely been able to film for the vlog channel at all because I have been working on something I am so excited about. It comes to my main channel on Thursday, so make sure you're subscribed there. It is a wedding series video, I'm not pregnant, but I have just been working nonstop on that this week, so I'm really excited about it. I'm going to actually go edit that video now, Thursday's video. Oh my God, I can't wait, I'm so excited. So I am going to just call it quits for this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. Go subscribe if you're new here and I'll see you in my next vlog.